attempt to steal a TV? And I am not having a nice day. Did you listen to my line? Well, you see, in PTU, or Pokemon Tabletop, Big Dream, something that happened in one of the previous Pokemon Pixelmon videos, which, mm, basically, I've pre-recorded all the Pixelmon champions, so this stuff is sort of like happening beforehand. And just in case things have not built up to this point, I thought I'd record this along with the video, so... I could just state something. So, last video, I'm starting to. Well, no, he didn't just threaten to kill Type Null. He said he was going to do it. And Daniel said, yeah, he actually, yeah. Now, let's see. Normally, when I do me normally, I would not have a problem with. It's like, oh, just, hey, could you not? Issue is, they brought up Chomper. Now, Chomper, I admit, it was just supposed to be, oh, hey, this happens, this happens. I didn't mind if Chomper got killed, because, well, yeah, that's morals. But no, you have to try and use that to justify the kill type, baby type. No. Now, I don't know if this has happened yet, or it's about to happen. Because the special change has changed it to where Pokemon happens on one every two weeks. And in the Dice Tossers happens the other two week the other week. Like one week is Pokemon Tabletop United, the other week it's D and D. So this is probably gonna slow this down a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, but, but, you know, I probably pulled down, you know, this, but, long story short, if I don't find any evidence that the party plans to kill Titan, no, you can have to trip one of them. Sue, well, that's gonna bounce. Like, she's going to leave. Because she believes her friend to be in danger. Now, again, normally I'd probably talk this out, but you have to realize why why it's coming to basic ownership of type no. This reason being is due to a GM error and something we decided when we first made the character. A majority of my character's story points get scrapped to the point where the legendary that saved her, aka this little guy right here, Type No, is the only story point she had left. And I do not take well to people trying to steal my story points. Now, to put it simply, I was already pissed because, like, yeah, it was something we agreed upon earlier. And instead of talking to me and us discussing it, Jim's like, no, 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 we're just going to scrap it all together. And yes, I like what he did with just making it half and half. Issue is, I would have liked to talk to him about it to understand, understand what's happening better. No, man, I'm just disappointed. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, I've already come in contact with Claude and basically told him I need a trainer to wreck the living shit out of them. I don't care how, I don't care when, I want to destroy that goddamn universe. I'm angry, I'm pissed, and I want blood. Now, I'm angry because because they were going to try and kill kill Titan Null. I get angrier when the reason being being that it was gonna be a little shit. It's gonna be a little shit because of how he, it was treated. Like, but 
understandably, yes, it has reasons to be pissed. Yes, it has these reasons. No, you shouldn't kill it. I mean, I swear to God, if I find your character about to kill an I find your character about to kill Titan Doll Ice Cliff Blob, I will murder your character first. I don't care how. I don't care when. If Titan Doll dies, Violet will leave and basically murder the goddamn party. I am not joking. I'm angry. And I want revenge. So, yeah, and yes, I originally thought Downhill was legitimately just copping out, but just sort of like doing the Titan Doll thing. Turns out he wasn't, he was actually, oh wait, nice lying skills Downhill. Granted, I would have preferred to talk to you first about that, but I will admit, nice lying skills. I did not think of the half and half shadows. Um, let's see, oh yeah, um, I'm pretty certain the only two characters I might try to leave alive are Apex and Umbreon just because they haven't tried to murder a certain Pokemon. I'm going to be sad if it's just because of its devour feet, but I'll take what I can get. Um... Also, I don't care if I'm the champion of Technol and you usurp Technol. I will hunt you goddamn down, Eins. I will hunt you down and get Technol revenge. Figure out a way to bring him back and then find your soul and stomp on you. Stomp you until you are a fine, powdery dust. That Giratina can't even see. Okay. So, what's going to happen if Titan will die? Violet will leave, return to her mother while she's in her state of shock. And basically, I get a new trainer. What happens if, say, Tegno survives, but I get proof that the party's trying to kill him? More complicated version of what I just described has happened, where I try to keep Tegno safe, and then I try to murder the party. Because fuck the party. Also, I warn you now, Lucas, I am coming for Dark right now. No one's safe from me. No one's safe from me. Apex and Vince, I will, like, Apex and Umbreon, I will spare my wrath. But I want, I will. And what's worse is I'm going to make sure I'm not the one to usurp them. I'm going to make them make the biggest douche or asshole or bitch ever to exist, even bigger than Grizzelia, to usurp Darkrai if it goes down with it. Now, honestly, I wasn't as mad as I was pissed, but that was more or less the thing of I'm pissed you brought it up and you're thinking of joking about it. And after a bit of thinking, I realized you're not joking about it. No, no, no. You wouldn't have worded it the way you were wording it if you were joking about it. So, Eins, I have taken time to think about what has been said, all that, and I'm not afraid to prepare the moves. Anyway. In I'm excited for Baby Titan All because, like, they're doing everything and everything. And I will be honest with you, like, 
sort of like I was trying to convey Apex's sort of like thing like yeah, Ape Apex, you were doing good, it's just the fact that with my character's backstory what you were doing was not working with her at all. It was legitimately not just okay, hold on, let me explain this. Um so basically back when sort of like she when pa yeah. When Apex tried to have her his character use the motherly regard thing, I believe. Yeah, I believe it had something with motherly. Um, that did not trigger a good effect with her because of how it, how her past was lined up. So, reason being that she's like this is, oh... Because of her parents. Well, parent. Not, I'm not going to spoil Violet's backstory unless I'm 100% certain that I'm probably going to have to go through with it. Well, that's because I don't think Apex has sent the legendaries yet, but just to let you know, Apex. Well, not Apex. I'm. Uh, okay, to clarify, it's 5 a.m. I haven't slept. I'm going to take my shower. Anyway. Ainz, Lucas, I'm, I have already talked with Claude, prepped the back of character, and I'm ready for the bullshit that you both may bring. Now, going on to a different note, we could set up these little point system things for when the tournament starts. We have downhill, we have me, we have Aurora, we have... I we I don't we have maybe right here. Um reason being we have a maybe is because I don't know if they're gonna be able to be drawn or not because I was not given a name well I was not given a straight answer. Alright. That being said, however, I feel like wrecking some shit. I'll see you guys later. Claude, I'm gonna have a nice long discussion with you. About some character stuff. In Apex. I'm Brianna. I'm sorry for what is to come. And to Lucas and Ainz. You both are gonna get your just desserts. And Austin, I'm sorry. I'm going to destroy the goddamn universe.